Well, next Monday is Memorial Day, the day we honor military members who have made the ultimate sacrifice for our country. But a special group of moms makes that their mission every day of the year. 11 News reporter Kim Dacey has details. Captain Jesse Milton III served our country for 11 years in the Marines before he was killed in Afghanistan in 2008. He was just 29 years old. Jesse was one of those people that people they were attracted to. Uh, he had a, just a, a, a contagious smile. His eyes just kind of like lit up. He was, I think, a natural born leader. Jesse's mother, Janice Chase, says after his funeral, she was approached by a group of women in white who identified themselves as the Gold Star Mothers, all women who have lost children in the military. A few months later, she decided to join. I said, you know, I'm not going to be swallowed up by grief. I'm going to let God turn my pain into pearls. Janice now serves as president and chaplain of the Maryland chapter. She and more than 50 other mothers dedicate their time to honoring veterans and supporting military families. We make uh, blankets for wounded warriors. We march in parades. We send care packages to our deployed troops. We, uh, you'll see us at BWI waving and, and applauding. Uh, the gentlemen and, uh, that come in and women from, for the honor flights. This year, Janice is speaking at the annual Memorial Day service at Delaney Valley Memorial Gardens, where they will honor those in the military who lost their lives this year and all veterans, past and present. And my message is going to focus on what Memorial Day really means. It's not about the cookouts, you know, it's not about all the hoopla and um, just having fun. But we need to stop and remember those. Who made the ultimate sacrifice? The ceremony is at 10 a.m. on Memorial Day here at Delaney Valley's Circle of the Immortals. It is free and open to the public. In Timonium, Kim Dacey, WBAL TV 11 News.